Hey guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. Uh, so, I've been thinking about, uh, well, last episode, obviously, we... This is like the fucking hour-long battle of, of the heavens. Uh, but I was uh, I was thinking of the problems that our party currently has and the way this game works, so... I was, I was a bit whiny and moany yesterday, because I was like, uh... Because I was getting... It's true. Well, I was getting pissed because Seabill kept getting fucking jumped on. That's Because I, I realized that this game has, like... Like, yeah, I can't complain, because it's like... You know what? It's it's the way the game works, so I have to play around it, and that's that's what I like about the challenge of games like this. So, I've been thinking about how to change our characters up. Um, so I'm starting to realize that a mobility is a huge, huge asset when it comes to a game like this, and b uh, uh, we need we need uh, yeah. So like uh, I need to I need to spec up my character slightly better. So. I was thinking about Red Prince, and so, I mean, he's got a two-handed sword, and I've invested a lot into, um, I've invested a lot of his his abilities into, well, right now, I well, I have one from Pyroconnect, but that's fine. I did Necromancer Polymorph, I have one in Hydro, whatever it is, because of the, the Blood Rain, I, I figured it was pretty nice. Uh, but the thing is, I'm not, I'm really dropping the ball, I think, on the two-handed weapon stuff, I'm not sure. Because I, I, I think I, I think I want him to have a lot of damage as well. Because the thing I was thinking about was actually putting him into warfare as well. Like I think I think warfare would be really good for him because he's got two-handed weapons. He does a lot of damage. He has a lot of strength. So I was gonna basically just actually maybe just do mostly strength for him actually. So I know I know we get a respec at some point. So maybe I was thinking of doing that. I, I mean I still think that polymorph is pretty useful. Uh, but I think it's good as a one-point wonder. Honestly, and I think I'm gonna focus more on necromancy and warfare. Uh, I'm not sure what to do about the blood rain though. I'm I, I don't know if uh, I don't know if you can get that on your character can or something. I don't know. I was looking at what I can get. I'm gonna like beast. I'm thinking let's keep him pure tank, build into geomancy as well. Mm-hmm. Because there's a bunch of skills in geomancy to require intellect. Uh, but I'm gonna keep on summoning, basically until like I have enough to like make it like a good sold summoning and then I start spec into like uh, Aerotherge baby and then a bit of Hydrotherge Hydro whatever the fuck water yeah my, 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 my question for you though is can you do like one point necromancy one point uh, Hydro Thurge at some point or or is that just like you don't that's really probably do that? a lot of stuff because like okay. I'm already you gotta think about what yeah. I'm gonna do in a turn I gotta think like my character's gonna be casting totems oh, yeah, summons right. I've already got all my AP covered, basically. Like, I can totem okay. and then do something else. Right. I won't, I won't, or do two things if it need be. Like, I, I... I won't make you do that, then. Don't worry about it. I, I'll, I'll do that for myself. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and remove a point from Polymorph. And I'm going to just use it more as, like, a... Like, it's a good one-point ability, I figure. But putting more than that is probably not the best idea. And then I'm going to get Warfare. I'm going to get get a bunch of mobility skills uh, to allow me to basically, like, like go back, go to Sabiel and help her out, or something like that. And I think, I think what we're gonna do is, if you get any tactical retreat scrolls, or we gotta figure out how to make them, I think we just gotta give them to Sabiel. And and you need to get Aerotherge for teleporting people away from you. Like the gloves yeah, are nice. Yeah, so but... I can get rid of these gloves at some point. Yeah, yeah, because I want to upgrade. I think that's I think that's honestly very important. And then I'm just gonna basically, um, I don't I don't know what to do for Sabiel's tank ability. I would really like her to be sort of. Glass cannony, um, and when I say glass cannony, I don't know. Uh, I, 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 like, okay, when I say when I say kind of like a glass cannon, I mean like not actually the glass cannon's uh, like talent. Because I looked at this, and I'm like, this is total garbage. Like this thing, like you start every round with maximum AP. She usually, she she starts with a minimum four, and she has five if she cases herself, and the maximum AP is is six. So you're basically getting one or two more AP points. You could raise How about that. This? Max, what if but... I, what if I split up all the scrolls I have and hand them some to Zabiel? I mean, what what she some needs of the, de what the the defensive ones? Yeah, like fortify and the magic uh, armor. Although that... I've only got one of the magic armor. The thing is, she's mainly a DPSer. I would only want her to uh, have scrolls if they're escape abilities, or if there's something that can like move someone away from me. If you have a teleport scroll, you give it to her. I have haste scroll, but that's about it. So something that's like a, uh, like basically, if I don't do something, she's going to die, and if nobody else can help her, kind of a thing. I don't have anything like that. I mean, I have uh, the love potion, but that's 
love, love grenade. Yeah, but that's... That, that don't, don't, don't for now. I'm just saying that's that's. I think I should be our plan moving forward. I think I'm still gonna spec her out to basically be like glass crit cannon, basically. That's what I. That's what I want to do with her. She doesn't have a fucking hat though. I don't know why she doesn't have a hat. <laughs> it's just. Do we have any kind of hats here? Buckets. <laughs> We have, uh, like that removes her initiative and does it even give her like any kind of like uh, armor? Is it worth it? So I'll see if I can craft you a hat. Can, uh, can you do that? Actually, there's a greasy cat. I'm gonna maybe remove the hat from fucking Red Prince. Actually, fuck this shit. All right, now she has a hat. All right, and now get give me a give me some kind of hat for fucking. You can give him a bucket. I don't care. Give the Red Prince something. Give me, give me, a, right, sure. give me a bucket. He'll wear the he'll wear the you bucket. Fucking love buckets, don't you? I fucking love them. They're the best. There you go. Three physical armor, less initiative. It's like, not like his initiative was any good to begin with. All right. So let's. Let's uh, look at what I can build. So I'm gonna give a lot more of my tankier items onto Sabil, I think. But she's the only one who wears finesse things, anyways. So I mean, it, it works out in the end, I guess. But it's just one of those interesting things. All right, so let's let's uh, I'm, 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 this is uh, I'm gonna build these characters now. I'm not sure what you think of the way Beast works or whatever, but uh, let me see here. What counts as high ground? Basically everything down there. Oh, I can I can make a teleportation scroll. Uh, how do you make them? It's one sheet of paper, one air essence, and a feather. Uh, okay. Uh, do you, okay, I can make, make one. one yeah, right make, just just make one then, and make it for Sabiel, and then Sabiel may have like a clutch. That's like, her backup, I guess. Yeah, like uh, like clutch scrolls on her would actually be like the play. That, that's what I keep thinking to myself. I'm like, there you go. She's still gonna fucking die if like let's say the guy teleports on her and fucking has three hits. And I'm just gonna have to accept that. Maybe maybe I should get her like one of the talents which doesn't let her die like the first time. That not the comeback kid. Yeah, I think it's... Is it come back yet? Yeah, when an enemy... You get 20% of your life back. Yeah. That that might be actually really good for her. Um, I, like, as, as I said, I just want to make her into, like, the, the fucking crit person. Maybe Stench would be very good as well. Might make her be a smelly elf. Alright, well, anyways, I've spent, like, fucking eight minutes talking and not doing anything. So let's get into position and, uh... Here's what we're gonna do. Um, you get... Uh, you wanna just, like, have Beast trigger everything? Like, literally walk him down there, and then you run back, and that's it. We're gonna just run back up up here. Oops. What do you think about positioning, too? Hmm? We should think about our positioning. Well, okay, the the the, the high ground here, I don't want them to be able to shoot us. So we ha we would have to be, like, around the corner, like, here or something. And we'd st we need our own high ground. The problem is, if they start teleporting up here, then... Obviously, that's that becomes a problem. So I'm thinking, as I said, like right here is where Sabil should engage at least. Like I'll have Ifan stand over here. Yeah, I, I have like. Or maybe I'll. Nah, I guess this one's. Right here is pretty good. We just don't want them to be able to shoot us from down here. That, there's that... water, there's blood, so I can be vessel here. Yeah. All right. So basically, we're gonna have to open it up with someone, and then and then you run back. So I'm thinking you open it up. Okay, before we um, continue though, could you save because I did that crit of crafting? Just so not to do <laughs> no, it again. No, no, I know, I know. Did I, oh, wait, why does Sibyl still have a point? Uh, I was going to give her like range or something. I'm just going to give her ranged. We're going to... We're basically... She's not going to do much more than maybe a point in Scoundrel. But I'm just going to do range because I want I want crit. Crit was so nice whenever it procs. It's so good. Anyways, go. Go, 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 go get him. Okay, okay. You just run in there, and then we're just gonna fucking make you teleport back and shit. Like, you can just you can just run back. What the fuck was he? Wait, no, don't sneak. What are you doing? Here, one second. You're hasted. Go, 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 go. Keep running. Alright. Alright, so shit right. spawns beside you. You're hasted right now. We're not in combat yet, so you just have to walk back. That's all you have to do. I could also just taste. I mean, teleport him back, but yeah, sure. I mean, e either one works. You just I'll want to chase him. Run him, run to the Red Prince on the other side. Uh, run towards the Red Prince. I mean, right. teleport means you might be just teleporting out of combat. I'm not sure. It don't worry. Stopped a bit. That's fine. You'd be okay. Hey, how's it going? Is it, 
Wait, what the? You fucking can run far. Do you still count as in combat? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're coming at me. Yeah, they're coming at you. Good. All right. I feel like this is cheesing it, but this 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 thing is really difficult to do it any other way. Are, are you still in combat? Oh, yeah, yeah, you are. Yeah. It's especially right. hard when they just kind of spawn on you. All right, Red Prince is up. All right, now, now Sibyl's in, com in, Sibyl, Sibyl's in combat now. Right, to make a decision now before you do your turn. Yeah. Do you want a water incarnate for more healing, or do you want a blood incarnate for more tanky damage? Uh, okay, one of the other things I'm going to say is I think our strategy should be purely offensive. Like, we just blow people the fuck up, I think. But that, that's that's just the way I, I, I think we should do this. But, I, I mean, it's up to you. Alright. Can you actually... Can I actually... Listen, can you make him try to make him bleed? Make him bleed? Oh, wait, wait, you can't bleed, he's a skeleton, I'm an idiot. Okay. <laughs> you just had an assault moment there. Alright, let's see. Uh, I guess I'm going to just do... What should I do? Uh, maybe I... Oh, I don't have blood rain right now. Of course. Uh, uh, but they have blood rain. Alright. I'm in the fight now. Alright. Just him. I'm gonna delay. Alright, let's see here. Let's, um... So I hasted you already. Alright, let's, uh... Say <laughs> like sacrifice blood. It's fine. It doesn't Delicious. matter. Let's decide we're gonna go like pure physical here. Oh, God. Yeah. That's why I want to do crits, Jesus. like, out the ass, man. Uh, I like I like the crit playstyle. That's what I wanted to build in this game, honestly. But we're going to basically just focus on everything that comes up, and we're just going to blow it the fuck up with everything we have, and then, yeah. I think that's the best way of doing this. I mean, it's a way you can play it, so we'll, we'll, we'll see how it goes. But I should be, hopefully, behind this tree or something, and they shouldn't be able to hit me. And we're on high ground, too, so... Let's see what the range of my teleport. Okay, so I can... If things get too spicy, I can teleport them back down the hill. Yeah, yeah. But... Not not too far, though. But just, like, I can do that. I don't think it teleporting arrows. Just saying. Oh, uh, no. I was looking at arrows I can <laughs> make, though. <laughs> I can encourage both of us. Let's do that. Alright. Prepare yourself. Yeah, and I will give my up, dude... Yeah. You can force that infusion. They can shoot for now. Alright. See, you don't seem to need the glass cannon at all. You seem to get like like a bazillion things you can do in your turn. Alright, he's almost dead. Alright. Uh, I'm actually gonna save his points and do the rest of them next time. Uh, that guy's almost dead. What? Why'd that guy? What? What, why do you unsummon? The fuck? Wait, what, what's the combat log say? Incarnate's time, 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 incarnate's time has come. That's all it says. That's not right. Oh, did you did you summon it and only had one turn left, maybe? Maybe you weren't in combat. Or maybe it wasn't in combat. Well, oh, maybe it wasn't it. Well, yeah, because it, it, the timer count counts down when it's not in combat. Yeah, but the thing is, like, I summoned it, and then I got in combat, so oh. it get in combat too. It, it may well, not have been, not, it not may not have been in combat, yeah. Oh well. I wasn't paying attention like the, to that. I was in combat, but the combat is... The, whatever, it's not important. Whatever, dude. That's the most whatever dude I've ever felt about <laughs> a whatever dude. Oh, man. So, uh, I'm going to just chill here, I guess. So the marksman may not be able to shoot Red Prince from where he is right now, which is good. Nice. So where's the, uh, the, the fucking void Wilkin isn't even there yet. Oh. Oh, you found the angle. Well, we found him. We're standing up water, apparently. Uh. Thunderbolt. Yeah, whatever. He's stunned now. Okay, unfortunately, the I'm out of sight from this guy, so I'm gonna have to actually move. Let's uh, let's haste myself since I'm moving anyways. And we'll uh. Wise, wise. All right. What do you do? Oh, armor frost. Yeah. Okay, so I'm currently. Sh Stunned right now, but I mean, you can just leave him be. You can leave him be. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Because there's nothing for him to attack anyway. So just let him fucking tank or whatever. 
Oh. I'll delay his turn. Okay. See if, like, maybe the dude teleports on us. You. I have found you. He's so fond of. Arg. He just did the Arg thing. <laughs> Arg. <laughs> he Arg does. Yeah, well, last time he did that, he teleported on us, did three turns at once. <laughs> yeah, he's saving all his turns right now. Uh, that's not nice. Shields up. I didn't need you. Oh, of course. Took a bit of that out. I'm thinking of doing just men metal, I guess. Yeah. Because Sabiel can do. How many action points is that? I mean, I don't want to get too close to you because we're going to get AoE to death, but I want to get out the water, I guess. Yeah. So, like, I'll stand. I mean, I, I want to. Whatever. I get, if I get shot at, I get shot at. I want to move Red Prince out of there anyway, so. I want them to kill. What are you thinking of moving to? Let's make it attached. Let's make Uh, that's a good question. Thinking like maybe up here or something. I was thinking the exact same thing. Um. Uh, well, I don't. I don't know. You should be more in the front because you're tankier than I am. Like you have like way yeah. more HP and things. Well, actually, I have more HP. What the fuck? What have you been doing? Why do you have more HP than me? Probably because I have like eight, eighteen points of constitution. Yeah. Okay, I got like I got like fourteen, and I'm like I'm splitting between strength. Yeah, that's what I'm doing, kind of as well. But I need more memory. I'm actually not probably just do... probably to step up my constitution game. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to do much more in, t in terms of uh, uh, constitution. I think for now, at least, because I'm actually going to okay. make him like very glassy. I'm going to walk him in. All right, then where should I go? I don't know. All right. Do you have, do you have any? Also, I wanted like because he has like a bunch of rush abilities. Okay. I guess, I guess I'll run, like, further back here or something. That's what I'll do. Okay, now you should be in range of this. There you go. Oh, cool. It'll help a little bit. Are you gonna be healing off that, or no? No, I don't. It's not healing, with physical armor, so at least, like, the ranger and the... Or the swash buckle up do as much damage to you. Yeah. I can also restore some... Yeah, I can do this on you now, it's fine. Okay, cool. I think, yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, it could be worse. Okay. Maybe I'll just go to the other side, like right here behind the rocks. Well, I'm sure angle. that reaches. Well, it wouldn't work too much because of the mending metal. Alright, I'm gonna focus on the Aeromancer because that's what I was doing before. Good call. Looks like something my sweat toad has been doing as well. Alright. Oh god, you can get him. No! Okay, I just want to move him away. Uh, he gets another turn at the end, so hopefully he doesn't get like... I don't know how I'm always in the front. I, I just I just thought I was behind the tree and that they would come... <laughs> they would find the angle, but... That was dumb of me. Oh well. I'm just not going ahead because I don't want to get... Uh... Get Plagro. Uh, okay, why not just... Because he missed his fucking turn because he was like... Yeah, I'm just going to do this. And then I'll take more movement because I have uh, some AP. The thing is, they're just all kind of like hanging out at the I'll bottom. I'll stand here so like we're not in fucking ricochet range, but I'll yeah. be ready to charge. Because I want to be able to like be able to see the entrance so that if something does come, I can charge it down. Yeah, okay. I got I got to be smarter with his positioning honestly. It's like I don't know like I I put him there and um wow that's like I really want to ricochet that now. You it is you. I have found you, Sabeel. Okay, he's oh, just some splash He's just not a part of this fight. All right, here we go. Wait, what? this is fine. All right. Um All right. I'll heal you if you fun. Yeah, I'm, I'm debating how to do this now. Should I should I just focus this guy down? Like, I would not go any closer to the fight because he's probably going to use the teleport abilities to jump on us. I mean, the big guy. So let's try and. Yeah, well, no, the guy that just came up here. Should I just focus him? Is a question. Jump on him, yeah. Why not? I I have death wish as well. I can potentially do. Uh. I mean, you have 62 physical armor right now. You're doing pretty alright for physical armor. Alright, I'm gonna try. It's this just. Building. As long as Sabiel kills the Aerith Dodge, what does that do? Uh, it hurts me a little bit, but I have like a lot of- oh my- seriously? How is this blocked? We lost. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, I'm just gonna maybe drink a potion. And then I'm gonna just maybe go up then here. Then cry a little inside. Yeah. 
That's so dumb, actually. <laughs> I, I, I thought I'd be able to hit him, since target is blocked. Alright, cool. Yeah, so Death Wish gives me, like, uh, damage based upon uh, uh, missing vitality. So that right now is 20%, and then if he takes a bit of hits, then his next attack will be, like, really good. I just, I was thinking about something like, yeah, I can do that. He still counts as shock now. Yeah. I'll go with power infusion. Prepare yourself. Yeah, there, hey. you go. there it is. Ta tactical, tactical retreat. Retreat. Retreat, finger quotes. And I'm, am I fucking stunned again? Yeah, I'm fucking stunned again. Whatever, let me finish this. Unfortunately, I cannot. Uh, one HP. Should I just should I just hope that your to your totems will do it? When does he get his, he gets his turn next? Uh, I mean, he gets Rick his Shane? turn next. Uh yeah, I guess I'll do that. I mean that's that. the next best thing, right? <laughs> I crit hey. the guy beside him. Alright, I have another point. I'm gonna use it on the swashbuckler because his uh, his uh, physical armor is almost done. Okay, four HP. You're good. You should be able to stun him down or something. Just leave the f the, the fucking prince. He's fine. I don't want to waste anything on him. He's not gonna do anything now, anyways. He's not gonna make the difference. Yeah. Alright, Okay. That's been a weird movement there, but right. This might work? Oh no, I can't, because shit. I should have bouncing shielded first. Alright, rip. rip. Rip -aronis. It's okay, the guy isn't even coming for us right now. Which seems kind of odd, but, you know. Hey, who knows, maybe it'll bounce. No, no, no bounces. I'll do it anyway. It's a bit of damage. Oh, he's coming. Hey, welcome to the hood, motherfucker. Uh, he got Seabill. Uh, Chilled, so he, that's actually not, doesn't matter for right now. Doesn't matter at all. Oh, he's coming! Oh shit. Who's he coming on? Oh. Uh, your fucking totems. Okay. Alright. He has all the fucking skill I have a Dracoon now! <laughs> Alright, luckily he, he's doing all our tanks, so that's good. Probably the only one of us that can survive it. Alright, I'm still- okay, so our plan is still just to focus down, uh, these guys, these right? These small- small okay. fries, yeah. They- they have both no armor, by the way. Or, yeah, no physical armor. Alright. Go, little guy! Oh. Okay. It's pretty good. Look <laughs> his movements. They're fucking fantastic. Let's get a blood totem. Right, I can teleport him back into the fuck position. The uh, marksman? Yeah, do that. Yeah, I'm putting him with his friends. Okay. I'm going to use my abilities here. Yeah. I know there's a Void Woken, but... I think, I think, honestly, anything we do, he'll just, like... I can't tell if I'm further away is the thing, so yeah. I just... Drop him right there. Have fun, shithead. Okay. Immune to bleeding. Incarnate's doing an excellent job, though. Alright, so I can yeah. hit the Cryomancer. Uh, yeah. Most of these... Well, I got a bit of high ground bonuses, potentially, on these guys. Uh, that's weird. The guy that's closer to us, I have a high ground bonus against. The guy who's slightly farther, I don't have a high ground bonus. But they look like they're on the same plane. I think it's because he's standing on the stair. The stair's slightly elevated. <laughs> I guess so. Oh, no, it's, I don't know, man. It's weird. Know. This game's weird. Alright, should I... High ground's broken. So, we're gonna go with the same strategy, which is like, I'm gonna focus on Cryomancer, then. The guy that's almost dead. Yeah. Okay. Just eliminate targets. Alright. You. It is you. 
I have found you. A beast is, uh... Beast might die. No, oh, I, I guy only had one turn, actually. Alright, do whatever kind of healing you need to. Or whatever. Okay. Maybe restoration would be pretty good. Mmm. Uh, well, when you when you get to your turn, on uh, on FN. I don't think you. I was gonna that. do men medals. Uh, right? How? Maybe a potion or something. I don't know. That's the yeah. It's like a men medal, same as a potion. So. I mean, it, it's your call. It's your call. I think with all the armor to regain, I think I can get away with just a small potion. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to go spending on my big ones. I know your carnate is crippled. Don't worry, he didn't feel a thing. Alright. What weapon's almost out of armor? Well, it almost means like half. Oh. So here's a question should I just rush in there with the bull rush or what? You're at full health. Yeah, I guess so. Alright, I can turn someone into a chicken. Probably the bigger one. The, 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 the marksman's got more health. Yeah. Keep so. him controlled while we kill the swashbuckler. The problem is, we're all kind of grouped up here, but what are we gonna do? Can I hit this guy? What can we kind of hit? Oh, because I'm crippled. So I can't move. Yeah. That'll I could happen. delay, but then I'm letting a lot of things happen. So I'm going to just uh, eat him. Unfortunately, I used that thing where I, I got more... Um, what was it called? The uh, the Death Wish. I used Death Wish. I didn't even get any use out of it because I was like in the corner there. Okay, I'm gonna put down a blood totem. Right? Game? Can I please have some blood? Like, I know I gotta wait for it to say, like, this is blood. There's, there's an ice, uh, there's a, a, an ice patch over there as well. I don't want to split into magic damage. Uh, oh, right, of course. Yeah, a good point. And let's heal beast. There we go. Alright, there we go, we got him. You, it is you. I have found you, Sabine. Scarred right. one. Hey Sabeel. Oh, what? This is frozen. Fuck you, Red. Fuck you, Sabeel. Fuck you, Red Prince. <laughs> uh, alright, so. Uh, we need to unfreeze Sabeel, I guess. Did she just skip her turn? I think she just got her turn skipped. No, no, no. She she goes earlier. Than I that. can unfreeze her on Ethan's next turn. Before uh, she even goes. Okay, good. Yeah, no. I, th I think I sh she did get her turn skipped this turn, actually. Because she goes right after Void Woken. That sucks. I'm just gonna start working on his armor. Uh, do we not want to take out the chicken or? Yeah, but I'm just thinking like right now I can't reach the chicken. Uh, I don't okay. have many AP. All right. All right. I guess I'll just. Uh... Like you just like you worry about the chicken. All right. Uh, yeah, I guess I might as well just hit it. Yeah, I definitely need some more strength rather than constitution. But well, that's something we'll we'll solve later. So I'll maximize my two-handed weapon damage. Alright. I mean it's up to you if you want if we think if you think we should unfreeze her, but I'll unfreeze her. Okay. With what? Just so a maybe I... armor? What kind of wand do I have on? It's air. Oh yeah, we're not freezing. That is a scroll. It's not a scroll we need to use. I mean, it, it, she just misses one turn. She already, she already missed one of, her, one of her turns. It's not going to be that effective, I think. I don't know. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, okay. As much I'll as it's nice, it. we're going to have to solve her problems with, like... Basically, just getting frozen like that, even though she was in the back. Because of her lack of magic armor, honestly. Healed her a little bit. Okay. You, it is you. I have found you. Okay, good. Vermin. He's attacking him. He's set decaying on his hit. Okay, so. Do not heal Beast right now. <laughs> decaying. Uh, oh, that's fucked you? up! What? Dude, that's fucked up! What? What did you get? 
He beat the shit out of Beast. Yeah. Cast decaying on him and then made him eat his blood so it didn't damage him. Oh. That's fucked. That's an interesting combo. I didn't even realize that's what happened. Okay, I need this one right now, Beast. Immunity being teleported. <laughs> Oh god, I can't wait till the fucking engagements we have where <laughs> that's a problem. Oh, 27 damage, can I do that? No, I can't. Shit. I think I do do one damage? No. Oh, this might cripple him. He's got 27 armor. Fuck it! Oh, you actually got him. It's crippled. Okay. Took him to the potion. <laughs> Wait, the small, Luke has a uh, medium Does that hurt him, or...? Okay. Fortify removed the decaying. Oh, I see. Alright. Well, um... What should I do here, then? Let me see here. I, I was thinking of doing uh, Tentacle Lash. Maybe uh, setting Atrophy on him would help. Should let me start with this. Yeah, we'll try that. Tend to beat his ass. Yep. And I guess I just hit him normally. Well, that one went much differently. Mostly because he just was like stuck at the top and then decided to teleport in, which is weird. Well, we kind of had it last time. Like I managed to stick him in that tree, but then you, it is you. I have found you. He still did the same it thing. of like I have you now. All right, use curse on him. All right. I can do the heal. I think I'm gonna do it on Beast. At least we have the Void Woken, uh... uh <laughs> we have the Void Woken on, uh, flank, so it's kinda nice. I'm gonna do this because it gets some bomb, I guess. Oh, he's stunned. Alright. Alright, am I full health now? Yes, I am. Excellent. Okay. You've been waiting for that for so long. Yeah, no, the, the, the thing is I get a bonus to crit and stuff when I'm not I know, you like the hothead. Yeah, it's really good. Like, I do get nice crit. big damage like that. Nice crit. Exactly. Uh, it would have it would have actually killed him if I had a, enough of it. Oh, we actually got him. What the fuck? Alright. Alright, let's go to... You know my voice. In the battles after you oh. suddenly realize the Void Woken called out your name. I, I just realized it was just there. Rally round. We've strength in numbers. The Void plays tricks. I pay them no heed. <laughs> why, why, why does Seville interrupt me? <laughs> fuck you, it's what she always does. Uh, like a beast and gets to say in that one, it's like, nah. Yeah, no one cares about him. Alright, what's the Void Woken? Holy shit, this guy. Can I see? Uh, I mean, let me go identify everything first. I'll just leave it on there. I mean, there's, actually, there's a lot of shit here. I mean, you 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 want to just look at it? I do, because I'm going to sell right. it anyway. I mean, I don't think we're selling a lot. Of oh. Let me just tell you. What's in crafting recipes? Yeah. Oh, hello. I I Seabell really needs some magical armor, I think, from that ring or something. But I don't know. It gives it gives arrow third or something. So maybe it's not the best on her. I mean, I probably want that later on so I can get the teleport spell, but for now I'll give it to Sabiel so she's on armor. So you want you want teleporting spell later? Huh. But I don't Oh know. dude. But Amulet of the Deep, immunity stunned, constitution, that's probably good for Oh, it has a rune slot. Actually both her rings give huntsmen. Well, I just realized hmm. that. Well, what do, you, what do you value then? I don't know, actually. I, I guess you can. You should just take it. Fuck it. Effing can have it. I don't know why I, I would want to her on it. Okay, so oh, it's it's oh, dude, those legs are really good. Oh, well, yeah, I didn't even look at them. What what do they have? What are they for? Not for me. For okay, the mage pants. Me. Oh, mage pants. Okay. When you say me, you have like two characters, and there's also an amulet there. We still have source callers on us. 
<laughs> yeah, I know. I'm looking at the animal like I. You got your it's fucking a good beast, actually. You got your fucking collar removed, and you're you don't use your fucking source ability at all. Well, it's because like dickhead. <laughs> You're like, actually, you're like it's, I it's, don't it's, like the fucking wolf. Why'd you play fucking Ifen then? Because I wanted to try out the wolf. It's not bad. It's it's tanky as fuck. It just doesn't have many abilities. Yeah. It's not as versatile. Okay, so the dagger's definitely going to get sold because no one uses it. Yeah, that's finesse. So like, not even Beast can use it. And the amulet, I'm going to say, would probably either go to Red Prince or Beast. The dagger? So I'll just... The what one? I'll let you... The... Plus one constitution, immunity being stunned, and air resistance, and the rune. Uh, I mean, I, I've been getting fucked in every fight, so maybe that would be nice for me. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to you. Oh, uh, but uh, the, the, I can't use it. <laughs> yeah, I know, like, neither can I. Source collar cannot be unequipped. Wow, why are you wearing a collar? I don't know. Cause Didn't I'm know you are into that. Because I'm a Yoshi dog. Rough, rough. Actually, I, I tell a lie, I know exactly that you're into that. Oh, uh, okay. It's because I hang out with Jack Witchell. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Alright. Alright, let's go looting. Alright, let's go check out what's over here. So we finally did do that one. Uh, well, there's... Let's see what's of interest over here. So we the did chest that. chest there. We did that much better now. Yeah, I'll go to the chest, I guess. Oh, uh, where is... Oh, there, yeah. I'll go, I'll go get that. Check these barrels. Trying to avoid the slugs. Game is hard, what can I say? Shrine to the seven. Ah, uh, it's just gold. Worthless gold. Your gaze oh, was gold. the solemn stone face that overlooks the shore. <laughs> so it took all the Latin. <laughs> moments, it seems as if its eyes come alive and lock with yours. I'm, I'm going to stare at the statue. The eyes, stone gray, turn Very pale cool. green. They mesmerize, then enchain, then lure you in. Uh, well, I'm I'm in the Hall of Echoes that now. Shrine seems to have brought me here. I'm in the Hall of Echoes now, motherfucker. Seeing yeah, spirits. Uh, the higher power, a higher power is temporarily granted you the ability to see spirits. As you learn to channel more source, you will maybe one day be able to use this powerful ability within the mortal realm. The fuck. Maybe I should look because I'm not source muted. I mean, can we all go there? Your gaze wanders over the solemn stone face that overlooks the shore. No, that's just I, I, I'm on a fucking adventure on my own. See you later, guys. Oh, there's a... yeah, there's someone here. The fuck? What the hell is going on here? Alright. Amid the sound of hey, how's it going? alien world, a phantom-like figure awaits you. Where the hell are you? All of that goes. How did you get over there? I used the shrine. Probably uh, only for, like, player characters. Uh, only player characters? Alright, I'm talking to this person though. She too is a lizard, as you can tell, but there are telltale details in her features that conjure memories of incense and mantras. The onyx eyes, three-layered crown, and feathered shoulders. You recognize her from the statues that stand tall in desert sands. She is the goddess Zol Stissa, greatest of the seven. Red Prince, welcome be. May your words command the rivers. May your hands direct the winds. Fire of sun and rock of earth. May they serve you like faithful slaves. Red Prince, it is an honor. To your surprise, the goddess sinks to her knees and bows before you in reverence. <laughs> uh, Cutscene say the honor is yours. Modesty? Hmm, it doesn't quite become you. She rises and considers you with deep-set admiration, like one would a work of art. Red Prince, God Child. Truest ruby of all realms. Tell me, do you know why you are red? Uh, that you're the spouse of the sun, say it proudly. Yes. The tale of your birth and the love born to you by the sun will always remain a part of your mythology. But I think there is another reason for your brightness. You are red, red prince, because all of you is hard. You are Carnage, and you are Concord, the Lord of War and Lord of Wisdom. You are Lust, and you are Love. You are passion personified. That is why I saved you from the all-consuming sea. Why I soothed your lungs with my breath. 
and placed you gently on the nearest shore. Red Prince, you are greater than all others, for you are the sum of all others. You are the Ur Father, the life shaper made manifest in a man. I would see that man a god. Uh, ask her if that's the reason. The divinity can be yours, and by all means, I'll take it. Okay. And take it you must, for I am a goddess no longer, robbed of my powers by the usurping divine. We, the seven, are gathered here in these horrid halls of echoes, dead spirits vying for rebirth. But none of us will be the one. One of our children instead. A god woken like you. I have chosen you. You are to be my champion. Uh, I am ready. If you are the chosen champion, you'll serve her. What must you do? A great battle is being waged. It is the twilight of the seven and the day to dawn of the one. The powers of all divinity must unite. And they must unite in you, the paragon of lizards. Our kind must rule this world, and none other. None of the primordial slime that made it onto two legs by nature's oversight. That's racist. Take up the mantle, Red Prince, and all will be well. All will be well. As she speaks these last four words, the outline of the goddess shimmers, shakes, then transfigures into an all-too-familiar shape. She stands before you in the guise of her, the woman you've been dreaming of for as long as you can remember. She is unparalleled beauty, and her skin's as red as yours. Yes, here she stands, your deepest secret, your deepest desire. She whom you've longed for since your soul slipped into consciousness, and you lock eyes with her. Look at her, save her the moment, and let your heart reach for her. Just look at you, Red Prince. Standing there in all your silent eloquence. I could drop a stone into the well of your heart, and it would take the span of a son's life for the little traveler to hit bottom. Such is the depth of your devotion. It is a good thing for the life shaper to possess such affection. For she too, your secret love, has her part to play in downfall and divinity. Now of divinity, let me give you a taste. She steps close, puts her hand on your chest, and leans in. Kiss me, my prince, for I am her. Kiss me, for I am your one true love. Well, well, all right, fine. The kiss is long and sweet as rose water. As it endures, you can feel a whole new power invade and expand your spirit. So I've learned the Bless skill, which allows me to bless existing surfaces, clouds, items, and characters. Using it, you can also cleanse cursed items. Oh shit, son. And guess what? We could go into that fucking place now. Yeah, we can go back there now. Yeah, okay. Well, let's continue this. There. It is all Stissa who is withdrawn from you, in her own godly guise once more. You will remember the, the kiss. No. Find your true love, and forget my kiss. Remember only the blessing I gave you. Cherish this purest of pearls I have given you. A droplet of untainted source, and a promise of things to come. I bless the very water beneath your feet. Now you may wield that power for yourself. So take it with you, back to our beautiful world. There, use it to make that world yours. I think I make and uh, say you're ready to return. Before I let you go, though, there is one more matter we must touch upon. You are traveling with company, yes? <laughs> they are an inconvenience, but yes, necessity is forced companions upon you. You have many dangers <laughs> to brave, and they can help you do so. But never forget what they truly are. Rivals. The rivals. <laughs> They are God-woken too, and may be courted by the lesser six. But you will be a god, none other. Smile at your fellow wanderers, but ready your knife, for its time will come. So, now we must part. With fire in your soul, and resolve in your mind. We'll meet again, Red Prince. 
Always will I walk beside you. The goddess steps back and waves, the warmth of her lips still lingering on yours. Then, sudden light and lightning, and you are gone. Alright, where are you at? So you already did your... Just, you, you, I guess you had a similar talk. Yeah, I talk with Relic. Who'd you talk with? I talked with, the, I don't know, the fucking Queen of Yoshis or something. Yeah, I had a dude who was like apparently my commander. Or like my god or something. I don't know. So, so the followers can't do this thing, can they? No, I okay. don't think so. I mean, you can try. Your gaze wanders. Yeah, no. Yeah, it's just for okay. the, just for the primary person. So, so apparently you're my rival, by the way. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm, I'm the I'm the main character. <laughs> don't you know, I won the arena. Oh, of course you did. I'm still source muted though. So what what's the deal with uh, bless? Oh, I actually have to have I have to have, have, to, have a source point to use yeah, it. Yeah, I have to. No, I have to, oh, do you? Well, you have. Well, I, do you I have, have that too? so I can. Tr yeah, yeah. Can we try it. Yeah. Because there's a source pool right there, and there's a replenishable one in that building. So let me bless you. See what happens. Uh, it's uh accuracy dodging. Oh, it's the opposite of curse. Good figure. Yeah. So you got tank here, and you have more accuracy and dodge. I'm gonna go talk to some pigs. 